President Muhammad Buhari's level of acceptability, respectability, and popularity across Nigeria was virtually put to test at the formal laying of the 2019 appropriation bill before a largely divided National Assembly. <laughs> Unsuccessful attempts were, however, made by some members to turn the session rowdy as President Buhari outlined the unprecedented strides so far recorded by his administration in critical economic sectors despite the limited resources. The world is watching us. We are supposed to be above this. This formally silenced dissenting voices in the Green Chamber, but the intermittent applause continued. The 8.83 trillion Naira 2019 budget proposal presented by the Nigerian leader is about 300 billion Naira less than the revised 2018 budget. It is made up of 2.03 trillion Naira capital expenditure, recurrent cost of 4.83 trillion Naira, 2.14 trillion Naira debt service, statutory transfers of 492.3 billion Naira, as well as a sinking fund of 120 billion Naira to retire maturing bond to local contractors. In order to get full value for money expended by the government over time and to avoid duplication and waste, our emphasis will continue to be on completion of existing projects. The budget is predicated on a $60 oil price benchmark, oil production estimate of 2.3 million barrels per day, exchange rate of 305 naira to a dollar, real GDP growth of 3.01%, as well as an inflation rate of 9.98%. As a responsible administration, we will continue to monitor the situation and will respond to any changes in the international oil price outlook for 2019. With regard to oil production, I have directed the NNPC to take all possible measures to achieve the targeted oil production of 2.3 million barrels per day. To be financed largely by 6.97 trillion Naira oil and non-oil revenues, the budget provides for the settlement of inherited outstanding pension liabilities as well as the implementation of the new national minimum wage. I am committed to addressing the issue of a minimum wage and I will be sending a bill to you, the National Assembly, on this. I am accordingly setting up a high-powered technical committee to advise on ways of funding an increase in the minimum wage and the attendant wage adjustments without having to resort to additional borrowings. President Muhammad Buhari explained that the 500 billion naira allocation for the social intervention projects has been retained. So also the 60 billion naira for the presidential amnesty program, while 45 billion naira is provided for the Northeast Intervention Fund, in addition to the 10 billion naira takeoff grant for the Northeast Development Commission. Our vision is for such better prospects for all Nigerians with careful economic management and the continued diversification of our production and revenue base, we will build an inclusive, stable economy for generations to come. We will continue with our emphasis on power, roads, and rail. We shall expand generation, transmission, and distribution of power from the national grid while developing innovative off-grid solutions for schools, hospitals, and markets. We will continue to remove obstacles, reduce costs, and ensure timely delivery of services. The President expressed the belief that the 2019 budget proposal represents an important step towards building the Nigeria of everyone's dream. What has become evident over the past three or so years is that more can be achieved in the overall interest of the Nigerian people when we work together. It is my hope 
that despite our current preoccupation with political activities, we can all commit to an early passage of this budget in the larger interest of our people and the national economy. Budget and National Planning Minister Uduma Udo Uduma is expected to give further details on this budget of continuity. Adamusambu, NTA News.